Hey everybody, Sky here. We're gonna be taking a quick look at the market heading into spring. We're in April, North County, San Diego, California. We're gonna take a look at three awesome homes that are currently up for sale, but I'm sure we'll be gone in no time. And we're gonna take a quick look at the market stats. Come along and let's check it out. And here we are in Oceanside, checking out this awesome three bed, three bath home. They're asking just under $2 million for it. It's just under 2,800 square feet, and it was built four years ago in 2018. If you're familiar with Oceanside at all, this is the home that has a view of it all. You can see the ocean from each of the four levels of this home. It has a rooftop jacuzzi that's available with the sale. From the highest point from the roof deck, you can see all the way down to La Jolla and as far up as Big Bear. It was completely custom built with high-end furnishings throughout. The owner absolutely loves this neighborhood. It's a great place to be and definitely worth checking out if it's in your budget and you're looking for a home with an epic view in North County, San Diego. And now we're in Carlsbad in the Bay Collection neighborhood. This home has four beds, five baths, and it sits on a lot that's 18,000 square feet, which is amazing for planned communities like this. There is an HOA, there are Melaroos. Total monthly fee is right around $280. This is in a great neighborhood with one of the top 10 ranked elementary schools in the area. It also has ocean views from the top, from the master suite. It has multiple outdoor fireplaces and is an absolute entertainer's dream. This is a great home and definitely worth checking out if you have the $2 million to purchase it. And now we're in Lucadia checking out this awesome single level home. It has two bed, two bath in the main house with an attached guest house that's approximately 700 square feet with one bed, one bed and one bath. Now, the great thing about this home is that it sits on an acre. It's surrounded by peaceful canyons and it has sit down panoramic ocean views. You can see the ocean, the neighborhood's lush, filled with plants, absolutely beautiful, cute and charming, and each home has a character of its own, which is one of the things that draws people to this area. Along with great schools, the wonderful living area, and homes with character. There's also no HOA at this property. So we're taking a look at the market stats heading into spring. It's April right now. We're in North County, San Diego, where the median sales price is a million sixty-five. That's up 27% year over year. Last year at this time, it was much lower. We did have more inventory. We had 1.3 months worth of inventory, but this year we have 0.6 months worth of inventory. The inventory is completely dire. Interest rates had started to tick up this month or this week. They crossed the 5% threshold, which is pushing some would-be buyers back to the rental market. But unfortunately, with skyrocketing rental rates and low inventory in the rental market as well, we're seeing the same challenges for people there. Housing affordability has taken a big hit this month, but with low demand and record prices, there are still homes selling for way over asking price. Last year at this time, homes were fetching about 102% of their asking price. Right now, the average in North County is 106%, which mind you, that's an average, meaning that many homes that are wonderful homes are getting much higher than that. It's not uncommon. And that's what's making it so wild. I've represented buyers that have had to write 10, 12% over asking price just to be competitive for some of the best homes on the market right now. Now, looking on that, looking at that inventory, it is exceptionally low. Inventory was low last year, but this year it's even lower. So if you're waiting to time the market to put your home on, this, on sale, this is it. This is the height of the market with the interest rates rising we aren't expected to see a repeat of 2008 because the situation is completely different. This isn't what we've seen before, but we are seeing record low inventory compiled with relatively low interest rates. If you look back in the 
early 2000s and into the 80s and 90s, interest rates were much higher. And some people are even starting to ask what would happen if interest rates reached 10%? How would the market shift and what would that look like? Right now, thankfully, we just crossed that threshold to 5%. We're still at relatively low interest rates. People are still fighting for homes because buyers are rushing to get in before those interest rates go even higher. The Fed's threatened to raise them continually throughout this year to continue to combat the runaway inflation that we're experiencing. So if you thought about putting your home on the market, there's no time like now. Although we've had a high 27% increase in home values over this last year in North County, that's projected to kind of level out by the top 100 economists. According to NAR, if you average every economist prediction out for home price growth over the next year, they're foreseeing a more average growth increase of 6% versus the 27% that we've witnessed recently. And if you've looked at home prices from Q4 of 2021 versus Q1 of 2022, it is a wildly different story. So, if you want to get out of your current home, move up, downsize, whatever your next dream home looks like, like I said, now is the time because you can buy that next home and still see an increase in the value and the equity and appreciation over the first year or two of that home purchase. Thanks for watching. If you found this useful, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. I sure appreciate it. Be sure to leave any comments with questions with questions or thoughts that you have down below. I love receiving them, love reading them all, and be sure to like this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a wonderful month. I'll see you next month for the next market update.